I studied economics at university decades ago because I thought it would teach me the mother tongue of public policy so I could help fix things in the world that need fixing. And I was deeply disillusioned. So I am part of a big team that aims to rewrite economics for the 21st century so that economics is actually fit now for the challenges we face, the reality and the context of the world. Today's students are the policymakers of 2050. They are going to be the members of parliament, the business leaders, the journalists, the lawyers, the citizens who lead us through this century. And what they learn is crucial for shaping their ability to guide that journey forward. What it takes is leadership to break out, to look ahead and to realize that change is not only inevitable, it is irresistible. So let's be the pioneer. Let's go where we already know the future lies. Let's have that ambition and courage and guts to step forward and say, we're going to put this at the center of our work. We're going to leave behind the old curriculum. We're going to leave behind the old assumptions of the way we did research and the way we built businesses. We want to be part and at the pioneering part of driving that future. And I'm compelled by the students I've met, by the lectors and the professors I've met, that there are many people driving for this change. So let's make the Javea the place that is demonstrating what it means to put new economic thinking into practice. A university of applied sciences is all about practice. It's all about learning from that in action. I profoundly believe that 21st century economics will be practiced first and theorized later. And we're better to engage in that practice than at Javier of Applied Sciences, working with city policymakers, with city change makers, learning through action. It's an incredible opportunity in a city that's already embraced the donut that's already embraced transformation, a low carbon future, a circular future. It's an incredible opportunity for students to go to university in a city that's already welcoming this, that already wants them to emerge as the pioneers, as the practitioners, bringing that future about. The right university in the right city at the right time, that is irresistible.